Again, God's people disobeyed him. So God let the Philistines rule over them for 40 years. Then he chose a man named Samson to set them free. Mm. <laughs> an angel promised Samson's mother that she would have a son. Samson would have to make three promises to God. Never drink wine, never touch dead things, never cut his hair. God made Samson very strong. He killed a lion, and bees made honey in its body. Samson touched the dead lion, breaking one of his promises to God. He even ate the honey. Ooh. Samson fell in love with a woman named Delilah. The Philistines promised her lots of money to discover why Samson was so strong. She asked him again and again. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, Samson told Delilah his secret. If my hair is cut, my strength will go. So, while he slept, Delilah called for a man to cut off his hair. Samson's strength left him. <laughs> when the Philistines arrived, they captured him easily. They blinded him. Then they put him in prison and set him to work, dragging a heavy grinding stone. <laughs> Slowly, Samson's hair grew back. The Philistines brought Samson into their temple to thank their false god Dagon for defeating him. Samson asked God to make him strong one last time. <laughs> Samson stood between two pillars and pushed on them. The temple fell down, killing all the Philistines and Samson with them. Samson didn't keep his promises, but God kept his. <laughs> 